Hey there guys, I'm Mega G Wolf and welcome to the Sonic Hack Showcase. Today I'm showing you a hack that I've been looking forward to showing you for quite some time since it's actually really good. And brought to you by all the good stuff. The project name here pretty much gives away what the title of the hack is, and the title if you're looking at the video. Today we'll be playing Sonic the Hedgehog Harder Levels. Now the first thing you must do in this hack is go into the options and change the game mode onto Expert. Why do I want you to play it on Expert? Because I want you to be as stupid as me. Now it's just because I decided I was going to show off the difference between the difficulty levels and I thought I'd start with Expert first just to get it out of the way. The idea of Expert is there are extra enemies, extra ways of killing you, extra spikes and no rings. Of course, in the normal mode, you're going to get rings and all that, but in this, you just have to survive as long as possible, and I don't do a very good job at it. It's probably because in Sonic Hacks, I'm used to taking hits with rings to be able to tank my way through, so this really isn't set for me. <laughs> I kind of suck at doing precision stuff without getting hit, since I'm used to using invincibility time to my own advantage. But, of course, as you can imagine, this game is a lot harder than most Sonic games out there, hence the name Harder Levels, and there are some dick moves and annoying placements. And I don't know why I got defeated by that motorbug, because I could have jumped, but for some reason I didn't. A nice little feature of this hack is that every time you die or start a level, the music seems to pick one of three and alternate between them. Okay, yeah, let's just play it on normal, and uh, I'll actually be able to show you a bit more of the game, rather than just die and embarrass myself. I do like what they've done with the music, it's a cool idea, and there is some pretty good Genesis versions of other music in this hack, like uh, some of the Kirby themes that I've heard in here are pretty good. So yeah, let's have it on original. Uh, you can also change the players as well. You can be Sonic, Tails or Knuckles, depending on which one you prefer to use, I suppose. Alright, let's go into the game, this time with, hopefully, a better chance of winning. <laughs> that would be nice. And as you can clearly see now, we have rings! Yay! And we just lost them! Yay! I don't know why I get hit by some of these things sometimes. I think it's just because I'm a bit reckless. Or I suck. Whatever comes first, you know? But, um, as you can see, a lot more manageable with rings and less enemies. But, uh, if you fancy a challenge, expert mode, or better yet, even hard mode, the one before expert, that might be a good challenge for you. Another really cool feature of this hack is I've known, I've noticed that as you go through the level, the background changes. It kind of gets a sunset feeling going on, and it does it while you're doing the level. And that is really cool. I've never seen any other hack do this before. And if there is another hack out there, I haven't played it yet. But I think it's a really, really good idea, and I love it. And of course, that's just one of the really nice graphical changes in this hack. As you can see, we're in the Green Hill Zone, but there is a level of detail that makes it a lot more nice to look at. And also in the later levels, the graphics are really good as well. It also seems that the bugs have been worked out on this game pretty- Oh wait, spoke too soon, never mind. And as we're about to see, the first dick move, if you go too slow you hit spikes, and of course if you go at full speed you also hit spikes. If you jump too high, you hit spikes. If you do anything in this hack, you hit spikes. Seriously. Actually, I can notice a graphical glitch whenever Sonic jumps or rolls. There seems to be a bit of distortion in his front area where he's jumping. I think Sonic is trying to channel the power of missing though. But of course, as you can expect, this game gets really quite difficult later on. So you're going to want to keep some save states ready. Also, I found while playing that the levels seem to take forever, but it only took me a minute 51 seconds. I swear it took me longer than that. Here was the first big surprise. Here you can hear Kirby music. And it fits really quite nicely. It's odd. Okay, seriously, what is with that? I don't know why it fits so well. It just sounds cool. 
This level will definitely give you that feeling of it's going to take you a while to get through it, even though it doesn't, purely because of how stuff is laid out. And speaking of layout, apart from the dick moves that you see throughout the game, most of the level layout is pretty good. It makes you go up and down, left and right, just to try and find ways to get around spikes and various other little traps and dick moves. And yes, if you couldn't already tell, you're going to be saying dick move game a lot. For example, this. You see those springs? Did you see what I just jumped past? Yes, a roof full of spikes. Isn't that adorable? To the left of those springs is an extra life, but I don't think it's worth it. At all. Ever. There was another dick move, spring into spikes, now we have to try and spin dash over spikes. So what do we have to try and do here? We have to try and get enough momentum to be able to jump over the spikes. But you could also be like me and take advantage that there's no uh, spike bug glitch and just hit them for tank damage I suppose. Ah! Of course, if you want to try this hack yourself, as per usual, all the details will be in the video description, including the link to the download. Ah, this is quite nice of the game, it's giving me a shield, which I doubt I'll be able to keep for more than two minutes. So I guess that's all I really wanted to say about the hack. It's difficult, it's nice to look at, the sounds and music fit well, and it's an all-round good Sonic hack to play if you're bored. And you're going to die. A lot.